What's up everyone, just a quick video here showing you how to get POM in Zeus 10.1 Preview. Now once you've downloaded it, I suggest you make up another folder to dump the shaders into. It just makes it a lot easier for editing. Once you've done that, you want to go into your gbuffers terrain.fsh and edit with notepad. Once in there, you want to go down to line 322 and remove those ones there. A lot of people reckon that's the only one you have to do, trust me it doesn't work. Not in uh, 1.6.2 anyway. Remove that one at lines 405 and the last two you want to get rid of is those ones there and those ones there. Go save, close that, and then once you've done that you can launch into Minecraft. Uh, once in Minecraft, you're going to need a texture pack that has POM enabled in it. Uh, I might put up a link in the description so you can download this one. Once there. Enable it, and there you go. Now I must warn you that it's extremely power intensive. Meaning that you're going to lose about 20 frames, 25 frames when using this, as opposed to the standard. Now, using fraps obviously, it's no good for testing your frame rate. But you can see it is a lot lower already. So if you have a decent enough graphics card, I'm running a GTX 770. And rain is not your friend. Anyway, I hope that helps you out. And this is my modified version of Sonic Ether's 01 shaders. Uh, you can check out the comparison uh, in the description below. Thanks for watching.